This tutorial is part of the composite material course that we give at Elastina Online and also on customer site. Uh, the exercise basically is to model the lamination in composite material. So let's say we already have two layers of composite materials right here and now we want to create a zero thickness cohesive layer between the two layers of composite materials so we go to mesh and then element generation click on shell solid faces and active so the whole thing create and accept so basically i created now shell elements between the face of every solid element then after this we'll go to solid and we go down to the cohesive element we click on shell we display the shell only part so hide the solid parts right there the shell part so active we selected that okay and then you go to the solid now deactivate the shell and activate the solid and again active and create so you see down here it says 460 cohesive element has been created in part four and we click done so what we have now we need to basically delete part three which is simply shell elements between the face of every salt element so we need to delete this one right uh, right click on part three and delete that part right there then this part here is actually cohesive elements between the face of every solid element we do not want to have a cohesive element between the face of every solid element we only want to have one layer of zero thickness cohesive element between the two layers so we need to delete these some of these elements as follows uh, right here so i'm going to delete the top elements and the bottom element and in the middle I need to leave them alone so element tool element edit delete by area make sure you do not select the mid plane of this okay and then the same thing so we selected all these elements except the mid plane is not selected then delete and accept and done so now we can see the zero thickness cohesive element right there in between in which we can we can assign one of the cohesive material models within within Elastina. but there is little bit more work to be done when we created the zero thickness cohesive element between the face of every solid element El ls post detached all of these solid elements so we need to merge them back uh layer by layer not the whole model layer by layer so we go back to first layer and then basically we go to element tool duplicate node active and you can see show duplicate node so we see all of these duplicate nodes merge nodes accept and then we go to the next layer so back to model and layer two element tool duplicate nodes active show duplicate nodes and merge these nodes accept and done so right now what we have we have actually one layer the next layer and the cohesive element uh, in between in which we can assign uh, one of the material models in Elastina for the cohesive layer we can use material 138 or material 240 which is the best out of uh, all the uh, cohesive material within within Elastina so uh, again this is part of the course that we teach on this uh, subject which is composite materials in which in the course we teach you as well what kind of testing are needed in order to characterize the material 
for the lamination simulation, what kind of testing we need to populate, all the uh, material properties and material constants within all the composite materials within Allostyna. Hope to see you in one of these courses. Thank you.